Put your body in ways that you don't understand But I'm losing my patience Cause we've been going over and over again Can I just so I'm taking my soft ochre paint pot from Mac with this. Whoops. Everything is dropping. And I'm just going to be priming my eyelids. Now I know a lot of people like to set this, but I don't because when I set it, it looks so ashy and it's hard for me to put the shadows on. So I just put it on and then kind of just smooth it out with my finger so that's not too white looking. I used to like laying low, which laying low is a good paint pot too. Um, but I like soft ochre when I'm be when I'm gonna be doing bright colors because I want them to pop, poppity pop pop. So after that, we're going to take the. This has been my favorite palette here lately. Can y'all guess which palette it is? Ding, 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 ding. The Saharan Palette by Juvia's Place. Loving it. Been loving it. So I am taking this um, NYX brush. And it is the number 32 brush. It's just a um, tapered blending brush. And it's NYX number 32 brush so I'm taking this Jamelia shade right here and we're just gonna go right into it and pop that right into the crease to go right up in the crease so now we're gonna go into the Socorro shade and be putting that into the crease also a little bit just focusing it like right in the crease like not you know blending it into the other color but not like blowing it all out like I did the first shade you know a little bit like it um I've been like so uninspired lately as so far as like makeup looks because I feel like um, a lot of the makeups that I like in trend right now like the more like dramatic makeup looks and you know I used to be down with the get down when it came to dramatic makeup look loved them but now I just I just opt out for more simple like looks that you can just put on and just go because Having a kid, man. Oh, I'm going back into the Jamila shade and just kind of buffing that out a little bit. But having a kid, like, I, I just, I don't be having the time to do that. Like, having to get him ready. Then my husband acts like he needs my help all the time. Like, babe, where's this? Where's this? Where's this? So, I probably got, like, 15 minutes to get dressed because... It takes them like 10 minutes to get dressed. And of course, I'm dressing my son. And all my husband has to do is put on a shirt, pants, and shoes. And he's out the door. And I got to do a lot more than he does. So it takes me a little bit longer to get ready. And they already dressed. And I'm not. So I get rushed. So I've been learning to do quick looks. But still make them kind of cute, glam. Not kind of cute, glam, and just for the moms <laughs> so now going into this Senegal shade and it is a gold these shadows are so pigmented it is just it's it don't make no sense especially for the price of these palettes man I mean So now, finishing off the eyes, we're going to go back into Jamila with this Morph MB18 brush. And it's just a pencil brush. And I'm just going to be putting that all underneath my eye. And into Sokoto. 
which was this shade here and going over top of the Jamila color underneath. So I'm going to be taking a really, really, really small brush from Morphe and this is the M508 brush and it looks like this. And I'm going into the Senegal color, which is the gold color that we put on the lid. And I'm just putting that right here. If you can see, right here. So now let's move on to my brows. And I'm going to be using the Goop Proof Brow Pencil from Benefit in the number four. And just gonna brush it up with this spoolie and do my brows. with concealer just to clean it up a bit. I'm using the Shape Tape Concealer from Tarte in the color Tan Sand. <music> using the Iman, I'm going to be two foundations today. It's the Iman Stick Foundation in the shade Clay 2. So this is going to give me the coverage I want. And then I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Matte Poreless Fit Me Foundation in the shade Classic Tizan. Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Tan Sand. <music> to blend out this concealer. Taking my Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm going to be putting that under my eye to set. I'm going to be taking the Prayer Minerals um, 4 in 1 mineral makeup and this is the color Golden Dark. And it has this beautiful packaging. And it is just a powder. So I'm going to be taking this and just putting that on my face. Sweeping away that under eye. <music> Moving on to contour. I'm going to be taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit Cinnamon Copper Brown. Mixing the two. Together. So moving on to 
highlight and blush we're going to be taking the becca times chrissy tegan i'm so excited to use this because i love her <laughs> and i'm going to be taking this blush here and then this highlighter here and the colors are hibiscus bloom that's the blush and then the wait a minute wait one minute Okay, so I'm gonna be taking this blush, which is the Hibiscus Bloom, and then this highlighter, which is the Beach Nectar. So this is the limited one that is in this palette. Um, so for blush, I'm gonna use the same brush that I contoured with, and I'm just gonna take a little bit of this. Pretty, pretty. And smile and just I'm going to be taking the, M, the Morphe M510 brush to apply my highlight. Okay, now. Let's just go. Ooh, shut your mouth, girl. Shut your mouth. Chrissy and Becca. Ooh, -wee. to be moving on to lips so I'm taking the Ofra New Orleans liquid liner and liquid lipstick and this is the purple and just let me put it on my lips So, gonna be going in with Night Moth from MAC and just lining these lips. Look at my lips. I've been lining them. Okay, so my hair is like this. I'm just going to focus on my edges. I'm going to be taking the Eco Salon Gel with a toothbrush and just brushing up my edges. Doing it like turn it around <laughs> and just doing it like this. tutorial i hope you all enjoyed it as much as i did creating this look for you all don't forget to give me a thumbs up and let me know if you like this video comment let me know what you want to see from me in the future and if you are not subscribed to my channel don't forget to hit the subscribe button also hit the notification button so you can be notified when i upload a video and i thank you all so much for watching i'll see y'all next time in my next video What's it going to be? Stay tuned. I'm going to show you what it is. Hey, I'm not a rapper, but I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.